live at the Gunnersville City Harbor, where she learned even though the lawsuit was dismissed, rough waters could still be ahead. Sierra? This plot of land behind me, crews are working on right now, isn't part of the lawsuit. That's why crews were able to start work in the last few days. Even though the lawsuit was dismissed by the judge, the mayor's office says the plaintiff has appealed. So this legal battle will continue. It has been appealed, and so it will be appealed to the Supreme Court. So it will be a very lengthy and costly appeal process. I asked Mayor Dollar how much this process could cost taxpayers. She told me that depends on how long it takes. According to court documents, the plaintiff and Gunnersville resident Joe Kenimer claims the city doesn't have the right to lease the land without a public vote because the land is used for public recreation. People I talked with today told me they'd like to see more development like this here. We can always use good restaurants and uh... I think anything that moves into Gunnersville is going to be a plus. I reached out to Ken Emmer's attorney and I haven't heard back just yet. Reporting live in Gunnersville, Sierra Phillips, Way 31 News.